hello and welcome to my channel uh, this is going to be a very long video i think uh, because i will make a swatch comparison mothership Pat patmograph mothership 11 against all the 10 motherships before her and this will be one video then it's going to be another video with the quads just because i think it will be a little bit longer and i don't want to uh, get boring so here uh, this one this is the newest mothership uh, that patmograph releases uh, yesterday it came to me i already post a full swatch video in artificial and in direct sun so you can go and watch that one and uh, first this is mothership first one of my favorite i have swatches of this and video with the makeup um i can i will link all the videos down below in my description box for you if you are interested to go and check them out uh so you can see <laughs> first these are very very different um the only um like comparison that i can make with this one is this shade and then uh, i can take uh the shades from uh mothership 11 so these all are like special shades these are this is like baked and these are, are like uh, not baked anymore it's more like a uh, metallic foils or i don't know how to call it um uh, if you don't know and if you are new these four shades usually from each uh, patmograph palette are the special shades the one that makes the difference in a mothership and the one that uh, ones that make a difference in the price point of this eyeshadow palette um so these are uh, this is uh from uh mothership one it is this shade in here i will not say the name but uh, i will point them out so you can see them uh and then i took uh these two shades uh, these two shades from uh, mothership 11 and i will swatch them on my hand or so for you uh, to see how this looks so pinky vibes this definitely has like a dual chrome shift um, it is like uh, on a purpley shift this is more brown and this um, is more like a pinky golden um, dual chrome or i don't know how to call it exactly um, but not exactly uh, similar now if i were to swatch um, the other three shades from uh, mothership one so you can see how this special shade should look uh, this is a very beautiful like topper it's a silver with bluish reflection it's amazing and this blue it's fantastic it has like silver and pinkish uh, reflection also and then um, the other two shades from here are this um cannot say um, it's more like a rosy gold than this and uh, this shade feels a little bit glittery you can see after i swatch it it looks almost wet i did not yet played with this on my eyes i'm very curious how this shade will apply because i see i saw many videos online people like not that happy with this shade but yeah we'll see how this will apply so these are like the special shades uh, from uh, mothership 11 and mothership one now uh, clear eye the fourth six shade in here very very different uh, what i can swatch actually is this which is usually a um, highlighter uh, shade in all uh, motherships from patmograph and let's see this is more silvery and this is more on the rosy tone 
so the first one was from uh from mothership one and then this is from mothership uh, 11 i will just hold a little bit here for you to see this next mothership it's mothership uh, two with the mothership 11 and from this point we start seeing <laughs> even in the first six shades uh like similar shades um so uh let's start first this highlighter every time uh this first position has uh like a highlighter then you can use uh you can see that in mothership 11 this is more like it looks silvery on the camera but it's more rosy a combination between a rosy very light rosy tone and silver and this is more muted rose i don't know how to say uh, uh, and next, uh, this is a very peachy shade, let's say in uh, Mothership uh, 2. And let's compare this with these two from here, which are like uh, also in the peachy brownish uh, combination, but more like more shimmer more metallic this is more like subtle metallic uh, this uh, for sure has a lot of shine in it and this is a darker brown now this is more like an beige color and uh, definitely the same family but not very similar with uh, the other three which are more peachier and now um, let's uh, swatch this and compare with the brown from Mothership 11. So this is Mothership 2, this is Mothership 11. I need to weld up a little bit this. Uh, this is more dark like black brown and this is more reddish brown and then this shade from here looks very similar with this shade from here um, but uh, yeah they are slightly different in tonalities now, uh, as you can see, in the first and in the second mothership, and I think also in the third, she has this extreme black eyeshadow uh, that uh, you cannot find it in the, her newest uh, palette. And this was the comparison for the first sh six uh, shades, the mattes and normal metallics. And now, um, let's compare first shade that uh, can be more similar with this uh two i think so i think if you look uh from the pen it didn't uh, actually look that similar but this two the one from uh, mothership uh, second and this color from here from mothership 11 let's swatch it side by side okay so on the finger they look very similar but um these are this is more golden this is more rose in a way and of course the other one is very very different um uh, in terms of colors and i think um i don't know this one let's uh, okay so this has like uh, rosy shifts or so so i think these are the more like similarities with this palette the second one with the 11 one um in a term that this shade for sure are from like same family you can um complement each other but not actually are not actually the same next uh, we have mothership third with mothership 11 again we have this extreme black shade that is uh, existing in the first three motherships and let's start by swatching this highlighter the one from mothership 11 it's 
uh, uh, more lighter this is more golden so this was mothership uh, third and this is mothership 11 so this is more golden this is more rosy now we have this uh, brown in here which is i don't think it will match with uh, any of the mats in here of course they can be used as a gradient colors uh, you can combine them but definitely uh, not uh, same now we have also this uh, metallic brown which of course they look pretty pretty similar but this is more darker from the mothership third and this is from uh, mothership 11 definitely same family uh, but not the same now this purple it's not like a special shade but i want to compare it with the purple in here and it is not clear eye and let's swatch it also this is mothership third and this is mothership uh, 11 the special ones uh, for sure you can use this as like a gradient look it actually look really good would pair together and let's take the special shade in here uh, with this one and this one from the mothership 11 uh, no, i don't think this will yes from the swatches you can see that these are different this is a nice duochrome shade and this is also very nice shifting now let's take this one with this one from here this is a beautiful purpley uh, i think multi-chrome i'm not sure i don't remember but yes and this is the difference i wish she would have more like these shades in uh, like in this mothership 11 and even this uh, color in here which is stunning and i will uh, swatch it here somewhere you cannot find this kind of colors i wish she will release this kind of with this kind of uh purpley green purples and not the same rose tone and then the shade in here i don't think uh, it's similar with anything from mothership it is like a rose with silver base and yeah it's a very special shade this one next it's mothership 4 which is like a very i don't know uh, a lot of colors i do like it um, but i did not use it i think i made also some swatches with it uh, I don't know from here what I uh, can see now is this uh, coppery brown shade with this one and I uh, they look pretty uh, pretty close to each other this is more brighter in a way and if I were to take this one from no this is more peachy way peachier um but yeah definitely in the same family and from what i have noticed in this one uh, you don't have this highlighter shade i mean you have this golden and this one which is a very silvery blue shade but uh i wish she had something like this this is an amazing shade this cannot be found 
or even close enough in mothership uh, 11 and even this uh, blue shade in here which is like and the pigment i don't know they feel very creamy uh, very different formulation this one from this one i can say uh, and i think also this uh, gray color it is amazing so um this is more like me colors let's say i wish she had some of at least one or two different than this uh, pinkish colors and now actually uh, i don't think except this shade from here which is actually a very coppery red shade which will not match with any of the ones from mothership 11 so not even a close even this will um, let's say make my heart to be more like joyful <laughs> you can see this color uh, and this silvery shade is a beautiful brownish silver color and yeah you don't i don't have anything to compare like this palette it's extremely different than uh the mothership 11 if you don't have it uh, swatching this now again it feels amazing quality so uh, definitely it is worth to have this one uh, in your collection and i think i skip uh, this color which is a beautiful uh, I don't know brownish uh, color which I don't think yeah it's similar with anything from uh, the newest palette it's a very purpley it looks more brownish but it's a purpley color on the purpley side let's say next one is mothership 5 with mothership 11 and from this point i think uh i don't know things start to look alike i think the one which will be um, again a little bit different will be mothership 6. Uh, again we see this highlighter shade that uh, she always have it so uh, this was from mothership 4 and this is mothership 11 and this for sure has like browns in here um, this shade for example with this one uh, or maybe even with this one uh, same family if i were to compare with this ones but definitely if you take all the mothership eyeshadow out and you make your own like magnetic palette combined you can see that are like families here uh i think this shade with this one in here this these two shades i think they look uh, pretty close to each other in my opinion and then uh the shimmers metallics that are in here in mothership uh, four very different from the ones that you find in here this i can boil it a little bit up so let's swatch this definitely different in a way but still in this rosy brownish theme now if you swatch all these four uh, mothership so this is mothership five i'm sorry if i said four and i can make like swatches here uh, this are very different special shade different colors different topes 
uh, toppers, I don't know. Uh, it's just diversity in here. And if I swatch the ones from uh, Mothership 11, um, you have and not that kind of diversity, in my opinion, at least. Just because these shades are like more in the purpley rosy theme. Uh, so, can't say that this red and this one, this is Mothership 5 and this is Mothership 11, very different. Uh, like how they look swatch uh, but very comparable in a way in this two shade actually i did not expect that uh, but now if you angle the the, um, the hand you can see this is definitely rosy this is brownish uh, but yeah i wish it had something like this in here or something with the, green reflective or even purpley reflecting but on a white base i don't know something different than the special shade that she has in here next is mothership 6 with mothership 11 and mothership ships uh ships mothership uh sixth uh six uh it's been releases and re-releases many times with uh, Star Wars format uh, with the stickers, it was on sale 50% uh, but I do love this uh, this one uh, from Mothership uh, so again, as you can see you have this highlight in here so let's swatch this three here like above and then i will swatch the other three under now let's take the first three from the new mothership and let's see how it is but these two colors actually look identical if i swatch them and look this is like slightly very 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 slightly pink a little bit but uh very very similar now the brownish and here uh for sure they are different and if i were to swatch on this other tree from here and this it is a beautiful army green which i actually love and then i take this tree from her new mothership and I so these are like side by side the first two rows the first three colors not the special ones so definitely this and this and this very similar um, this topper uh, it's metallic it's different it's more peachy this is more coppery browny and this is an army green really really nice so this is Mothership 11 and this is Mothership 6. Now let's swatch the special shades in here. And I will do the same. I think this is way better. You can see diversity. <laughs> Actually diversity you can choose, you can have like a bright highlighter a golden one a purpley one this will like i i would love to see this kind of shade in that one in the new one now again let's swatch this side by side so you can see you have one golden which is more also on the rose side it's not a proper golden one um i mean i'm speaking and comparing these colors from my perspective and what i would like to have in a mothership in a new one uh, when i'm paying this kind of money uh, i'm not shaming in any way this palette if you don't have any mothership this is a beautiful uh, 
color uh, team mothership and uh, they swatch really really nice uh, i did not apply them on my eyes but it's just my personal preference and what i want to have in a mothership and from mothership 7 the fun begins because from this point uh pet McGrath started to launch almost like rosy <laughs> motherships uh in a way so um i will swatch in the same way that i swatched the previous two i think it is the best way to see this side by side so this is mothership seven and let's swatch with this one and let's see this highlighter shade so you can even see that this it's kind of complementing each other the mothership 7 and mothership uh, 11 in a way uh, this is more silvery this is more rosy again more rosy and this is also more rosy and if i were to take the next shade from mothership 7 and let's swatch here and now the shades from mothership 11 so it's practically <laughs> a little up the upgrade i don't know how to say it except this peachy uh, coppery color uh, it's like very similar these colors they are very very similar of course they are slightly different but uh i mean if you have one you don't need the other and now let's swatch uh, this special shades in here that yeah i think swatch them in the same way so you can see how this shifts this color you see this is white and then you switch and it is rosy very beautiful this is a beautiful silvery topper and this is also has golden with pink in it uh, amazing special colors that it's i think that's why mothership 7 was such a success and this is actually very beautiful shifting colors special colors and now uh, let's swatch again this <laughs> I probably hit pen how much time I swatch them and put them like side by side so you can see this uh, except this one that actually shifts in some golden um, this is like uh, a brownish purpley shade with a little bit of shifting uh but not as special and this has flakes i don't know how this will apply on the eyes uh but uh, definitely you need something to stick uh on the eyes otherwise it will have all over the face but look at the uh, special shade how they reflect and how different they are and uh, yeah even this one's uh scream like you can use them in so many different ways so again mothership uh, 11 and this uh, special shades and these are mothership 7 special shades next one it's mothership 8 which if you look to each other it's like her big sister i don't know uh very <laughs> pretty similar shades we will see how uh, this will look i'm also very curious so same procedure swatching this so this is mothership eight then we take mothership 11 under again you can say that this complements each other uh, different but rosy tones again not even uh purple i mean this is a little bit 
purplish, let's say. And the next one, this bright colors color really nice. And actually this from Mothership 8, with this one, which is this color here, pretty similar swatch on the hand, pretty, pretty similar. I mean, you can definitely, if you have one, you don't need the other. Let's swatch under the shades from Mothership 11. So even this shade in here, the first one from the uh, second row, it looks swatch pretty close to each other. This is more peachy, this is brownish, this is a bright pink and yeah, this is a brownish. Uh, color and now let's uh, get to the special shades in here again I will swatch it like this so this is a beautiful dual chrome shade I don't know if the camera picks is up but it is beautiful and again, we have a golden and uh, like, it's not that silver, it's more on the golden side of the sil silver. I don't know if that makes sense. And now again, I think this will be the most used of this palette. Um, you can see how this look side by side the special shade the formula trying to move my hand for the camera to pick uh, to pick up how this color shifts because in the end you are paying for these ones i mean these are the ones that make the difference uh, from other eyeshadow that uh, are on the market and if you are wondering why on the floor is because <laughs> This is the room where I have the most uh, light in here, especially in this area. So I usually film my swatches here. I like uh, to use the natural light and not artificial. That sometimes can change uh, how these colors look. So we reach Mothership 9, which <laughs> uh, with barely... Yeah, uh, it looks kind of similar uh, let's swatch this three and these are the first three from mothership nine the ones from mothership uh, 11 so it's like dupes I mean you can almost say they are identical the next three from mothership nine and swatch them here and then the three shades from mothership 11 swatch them below so i can say the first for i mean this three and this for shade and mothership 9 and 11 it's like almost identical in my opinion this is more coppery this is more pinky and then the um yeah the difference in here it's very visible now um don't remember well if these also special shades are not baked anymore I think they are not, uh, but still you get like a nice diversity as you can see here. This shifts in a beautiful uh, army green. Uh, this is a silver with pinkish uh, reflects uh, a little bit of green also. I don't know. It's just beautiful. And this purpley 
this purpley shade it is beautiful so these are the special shades from mothership 9 and again let's take the ones from mothership 11 and place them exactly above so of course in terms of um, special shades i don't think you have something similar in here uh, very different regarding the color theme uh, but yes you can see that mothership 9 you have diversity you have greens you have silver with greens with rose nice purpley shifting uh, a nice coppery shade it's not only like i don't know this reds rosy reds and we finally reach to the last mothership mothership 10 with mothership 11 so let's start swatching dip a little bit in this red swatching this again first two shades pretty similar one with another this is slightly more bright and of course this is the difference this is gray and this is brownish and then the last row from uh, mothership 10 And the last row from Mothership 11. And yeah, it's not as similar as Mothership 9 with Mothership 11, but still you have these rosy shades that, yeah, you have it everywhere in all her palettes. And even the highlighter, it's, I mean, this is more silvery, but in the end, I think it's pretty similar now let's swatch uh, the special shades in here these are the special shades i will swatch them same and even here you have like this divide diversity uh, this is a beautiful purplish which got, gets a little bit darker uh, when you shift this is a beautiful uh, golden again another silver purpley shade this one and then you have a rosy golden also and now the last of this swatching for today anyway so here you can see um, the golden uh, shades in her special shades, they, they look in the same family with a little bit of rose uh, inflection maybe or I don't know, purpley, but uh, yeah. But uh, for sure these shades are not similar in any way from Mothership 10 or 11, but yeah, same family. So that was the entire uh, comparison with uh, Mothership 11 and all the Mothership that I won. Uh, what I can say is that I don't uh, hate this palette. It's not one of my favorite, but it is a nice palette. If you are not a collector, if you never used a Petnograph Mothership, if you want to try one, uh, definitely this is one for you and of course the color theme if you like this kind of colors uh, yeah go for it um, i'm just comparing here in terms of what she uh, released before and the diversity that uh, it was at least in the four the first four motherships and then in mothership six because from mothership uh, seven you can definitely see these rosy tones that I think people love, but not all the people. So um, I do like this palette. 
I uh, by now I only swatch it so I did not use it on my eyes I don't know how these uh, eyeshadows perform so I cannot say that uh, this is one of her best uh, formulas uh, but uh, yeah in terms of uh, <laughs> but in terms of, of colors this is uh, or was my video uh, I hope uh, it was helpful in a way if you are deciding to buy any mothership um, I think tomorrow I'll make comparison with uh, my quads or maybe I'll do the makeup I don't know uh, this requires a lot of work of uh, erasing like cleaning them and yeah trying to because my fingers got stained now from this rosy shade um, but uh, yeah if you watch to the end thanks for watching uh, don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you like what I do because I doing this kind of swatching comparison all the time and um, see you next time bye bye